Good morning to all. Today I am going to introduce you to the various themes of Buried Child written by Shepherd. The very first theme is the various family relationship that is existing within a stereotypical American family. The opening of this is very unique. In the living room of a rural Illinois farmhouse, Dodge, a sickly old man, sits on the couch watching an old television. Here, the Dodge becomes the central character. He is the representative of a broken American family. He is the head of a typical broken American family and the relationship that he shares along with his wife Haley and his sons is quiet, depressing as well as a shattered one. And all these things are very much revealed in the very opening scene. The shattered relationship that is being shared by the familial members is being revealed by the couple's arguments. They argue each other over various relationships as well as the shaving of Dodd's hair by his son is a representation of some sort of burial. From the very beginning itself, we understand that they are trying to cover up or conceal a hidden fact that is a part of the familial history. Tilden is being introduced. He is the elder son of the family. But even if he is ha holding a handful of corn, corn becomes here the symbol of harvest, rebirth, hope. But we could see that both Dodge as well as his wife Haley is rejecting the presence of the corns within the nearby farm. In addition to that, they become a unique portrayal of a broken American family by portraying this idea that they are trying to conceal something. At the same time, the mentioning of their past glory an era when their farms were completely fruitful and we could make a possible comparison with their past glory to that of the present condition which we could feel a comparison with T.S. Eliot wasteland the broken images the family relationship can be simply considered as a puzzling one as we are not aware about what is happening within the family even the members within them are completely unaware of this. We, the readers, are now in the very opening are confused about the relationship that or the bond that the members share within that family. The very opening of this work actually covers the most important themes like the weak patriarch that is being existing. In addition to that, the failure of the American dream and the collapse of a family. In addition to this, the indifference that is being shared by its family members that adds to the confusion as well as the puzzling within the readers. And the two adult sons, namely Tilden and Bradley, are being introduced as incapable sons or the examples of the dysfunctioning family. They are not even able to take care of their own aging parents like we all expect. In addition to this, Bradley is being characterized as an abusive one. Tilden is unable to protect himself as well as he lacks an emotional response to his father's illness. We could see a lack of empathizing within the family. And the appearance of the corn, as I already mentioned in the first slide, about that they are neglecting the presence of the corn. This indicates the very motive of this play, that is the harvest, that there's some sort of possibility for a rebirth or renewal, rejuvenation. But they are not ready to accept its presence. And they even accuse the son for stealing it because they know that 
they they are in a stage where they completely believe that a rebirth is quite impossible for them this echoes the idea of the wasteland that t s eliot shares that this family becomes a very image of heap of broken images where the rebirth or the possibility of rejuvenation is impossible since it is barren the mentioning of children's former athletic powers demonstrate a uniquely american kind of nostalgia it's implied that the family once has achieved the american dream this actually put forward between us the idea that america used to have that it is a land of dreams where one could possibly make all those dreams come true in america and once we could see that this family also holds a certain dignity or uh, they were in a higher strata of the society they own a wonderful farm that is very fruitful they were having kids who was a football star but now just like the american dream their family is broken now they own a barren farm in addition to that they have two useless or two devastated or collapsed sons american dream becomes the next theme of this work the next theme is the past trauma the whole family members is undergoing to a traumatic condition and that is very evident both in their sayings as well as, as well as in their doings hail is denial of the corn's existence aligns are with dodge mirroring that they are refusing themselves or they are trying to conceal the past crimes that even the readers are unaware of and hail is walter reaction towards children is in a way of representing of her intense and absolute refusal to revisit the fa- family's past trauma here we also could see the childlike and helpless state of each of the family members the family's dark past when started to bubbles up tilden seems to confront it but dodge just like its name suggests tries to dodge it shepherd in this way presents another obviously poor choice for dodge's possible replacement in bradley bradley's abusive behavior towards his father exposes even more bitterness between the family members and the bradley's violent shaving of his father's head can be associated with death that and takes place at the very end of this play like shaving a prisoner before his execution or shearing a lamb before slaughter here we could see a christian image at the same time it becomes shaving becomes a symbol of revealing or uncovered truth In a sense, Tilden is helping his ill father and tucking him in a coach foreshadows a sort of burial process that is going to take place at the very end. The symbolic burial further emphasizes the power shift occurring in the family and displays Tilden's strange mental processes, thus revealing that Tilden is also a part of the past that both Haley as well as dodge is trying to conceal family is a place where one could share the happiness or share deep bonds within each others but what this family represents is nothing but alienation that is existing within the members although the house reminds shelly who is being introduced as a representative of the care audience that At first she believes that it is a stereotypical american family but the unique behaviors in addition to the indifference shown by its members actually covers that misunderstanding that that was nothing but she just misunderstand it to be a happy family just like we readers do now we understand that the family members are estranged completely they are actually in a horrible pathetic condition that they themselves don't know the way to come out of it and in short we could say that they are at the very 
higher level of distrust in as well as that of alienation the carrots just like the crops or the cones that is being shown in the first slide becomes a symbol for the possible redemption or a new life the next theme can be considered as the cynical viewpoint on religion Dewey's joke encapsulates the play cynical viewpoint on religion Haley broadly uses religion to justify her sense of right and wrong she just as wicked as the people she condemns and she knows it and doesn't feel guilty this sequence of pseudo burials symbolizes the ongoing transfer of power within the family the dying doge is buried by the banquet and this burial simultaneously removes bradley from power and puts him at his most vulnerable state the family's toxicity drives shelly to take dodge suggestion from earlier in the act in order to have a voice her actions become more consistent with those of the family she becomes infantile bullying and grotesque in her actions the longer she stays in the house in short we can say that shelly was in a uh, confused state in seeing this familial conditions and uh in addition to this the winds the younger son becomes a image of the he started to follow the ancestors we could see a reflection of his ancestors within him so in this towards the end we could see a cynical viewpoint of religion from the jokes being given by dewis and the ailes dialogues regarding or her way of considering right and wrong with the help of religion she also sought the help of religion in order to hide herself from the reality the very end actually introduces the theme of a rebirth the corpse that is of the murdered child is being taken out it is being harvested a rebirth is what shepherd introduces through this reviving of that murdered child the concealed truth is being revealed within the family this actually gives ambiguous note that the possibility of both a positive and a negative turn that the family could take place wins seems to have already become the new version of dodge since the truth is being revealed there is also a possibility for a new rebirth but since instead of being emerging as a revived person resurrected symbol of jesus we could see that wins turns out to be just or the mere shadow of dodge who is completely drunken in a very shattered and pathetic situation so this very end actually emphasizes the theme of rebirth or the conclusion actually gives a ambiguous note of possibility of hope at the same time ends with a brutal revealing of the truth of the buried child the substantiating the very title of this work by this i conclude thank you